What's up, y'all? Thanks for checking out another video. It's your boy. Now, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make custom snapback hats just like this one you see from my clothing brand. Now, this is our Phoenix version of the cap. It's a sport cap, and I went all crazy on this. Look at the inside trim. You can see it still has our brand in there, and I want to be able to show you guys how to make hats just like this. These are our first set collection of hats that we have for our own clothing brand, and I want to be able to show you guys how y'all can do it too, either with a machine or with a company. Uh, which I would recommend just go ahead and doing a company um, and do it bulk so you're not actually doing it. Now, it depends if you guys wanna go ahead and do it, then you're gonna have to get a special machine which is gonna cost you about 10 grand. And now we're talking about doing a business loan or a business credit. All right, so first starting off, you guys got two options. What you can do is either order a whole bunch of blanks from either a blankshirt.com or any other type of warehouse that will sell you just blank hats. Now, when you get your hat, you're gonna have to be able to come up with your own design and take that blank hat to one of the small businesses around in your city and be able to give it to them and say, hey, I wanna be able to get this embroidery, either flat embroidery or 3D embroidery. Some of these shops pretty much uh, do either large quantities and some of them don't do small quantities. If you have a shop that's gonna do a small quantity, basically they're gonna charge you a lot of money up front because you're bringing them like four hats or six hats or 12 hats. Some of these companies will be able to take you, but they all, they're all they already just looking for someone that's gonna say, hey, I want 120 hats, embroidery, show me what's gonna be, show me the price. Now, messing with America, America is gonna charge you so much. And I am not into making my own hats because if you do that, then you're gonna need an embroidery machine. And then that embroidery machine is gonna cost you about 10 grand. And that is not something that is starting off as a new business, something you kinda of wanna just run into like that because you don't know where your sales are gonna come from. Now, before we get started, you already know the deal. Make sure you guys go ahead and hit that like, hit that subscribe, it's totally free. Helps out the channel and it helps out me and my family. So if you guys like this content, run us up, hit us up, hit that like and subscribe button. All right, kicking this video off, I'm not gonna have you guys too long. I wanna get straight to the point. Now, there's two ways that you guys can do this, which I just told you guys the one way. Now, the second way you guys can do this, which I am gonna recommend, is the how you can make custom snapback hats like this, is to literally start to go to Alibaba.com. This is where I got all of my hats from. Now, after you get those designs, go to your computer and type in Alibaba.com. Now, once you get the Alibaba.com, you're gonna go in into the search engine. You, all you're gonna ask for is custom snapbacks. Once you go into custom snapbacks on Alibaba.com, make sure you check out the reviews, check out how long they've been in business, check out the stars, check out the photos. Make sure you take your time and you know what type of snapback hat or fitted hat that you want. Once you know what type of hat that you want, you wanna make sure you go ahead and talk to the person that you're dealing with. That is the sales rep that you go, that's gonna be handling all of your stuff. Once you know what type of hat that you're gonna be getting, like me, when I started, I saw that I wanted the hat that had the holes, but I also wanted a sport cat that people can play golf in, tennis in, and a regular casual hat. So I had a photo of the hat that I wanted. And once I found the company that I was gonna deal with, I made sure I messaged them, send them the photos, send them the designs, make sure everything is like a, either a PNG. And we talked a long time on discussing about how the hat and the material for the hats is gonna be. Dealing with Alibaba, always gonna pay a high price for samples. Now where the price breaks down at is when you start to do bulk. For instance, I literally just spent $1,800 on 150 black hat. The sample for these were $45 just for one hat. One hat was $45. Now the bulk is gonna cost me $5.06 per hat. Now, the thing that's gonna cost the most when you're dealing with Alibaba is the weight of the hats. Now I had to pay $675, $675 just for shipping. And then taxes was $101. So that's what was my total that came up 
for $1,800 and some change. So even though they come out cheaper when you owe more, the weight and the shipping is what's gonna hit you the most. But that still don't matter because I'm selling these hats for $39.99, basically $40. And with that and with the shipping, it ends up to be about, for the cost for the hat, about $12.50. Now, if I'm selling the hat for $40 and the cost of the hat is $12 and some change, that means I made how much on profit? Let me know in the comments. We also got visors that we've got made in all different type of colors, um, just to show variety. So once we put all of this on the website, people will not only see that we have uh, hats and visors, but they'll also see that we got different colors. And this is what you're supposed to do when you're starting your own clothing brand, is you wanna get like a design that works and then start doing different colors to introduce out to people. So since it's summertime, we're starting with the light colors for these visors, which are also selling out. So I hope this video helped you guys out a lot. If you guys plan on making custom hats, getting the machines, that way, that's gonna be another process. I didn't wanna go that route. If it's up to you, more power to you. Um, but I decided to just have a company do it, make a few samples. What we do is we take those samples, I wear it, I get some lifestyle photos with some models, we go ahead and take those photos, place them on our Shopify website, and then that's when we start doing our advertising and advertising and Facebook advertising and Instagram and TikTok on the videos to try to draw interest for our hats. Right now, this cactus hat is actually doing pretty good. We sold about 25 of these, and we only need about 70 to make our profit. And we got 150, so the rest of those hats are gonna be all profit, especially once we reach that 70 mark. So that is how you guys do a clothing brand or start a clothing brand and with custom snapback hats. I would recommend you guys probably start some to get some little bit more variety in your store, whether than t-shirts and hoodies. Try it out. Let me know how you guys think about it in the comment section. Until then, make sure you guys hit that like, hit that subscribe button, write a comment down below. It's free, it helps the channel out, and it helps me. i see you guys out there another day. Stay restless and create your clothing brand. Peace.